Hey, thanks for coming back to the channel. Hey, listen, uh, I've kind of had it with this language about gun violence epidemic, this whole epidemic. First, it is impossible, impossible to have a gun violence epidemic. It's impossible to have a violence epidemic. Why? Because and the term epidemic can only be used when referring to a biological vector, a disease. A gun doesn't carry a disease and a bullet isn't a virus. Uh, so the use of the term epidemic is purely hyperbole and designed for propaganda purposes to create some kind of emotion to associate gun to associate guns with germs i refuse to accept that and anyone whether they're a medical professional i don't care cdc world health organization you are committing malpractice by using the term to refer to what's going on with uh, violence in the country right there is not even a violence epidemic, in quotes, if you want to look at it that way. Let me explain why, and here's some data for you. All of this comes from the FBI database. If you don't believe me, go look it up, do the research. Um, first, in the U.S., um, there are 3,000 counties and independent cities. St. Louis, for example, is an equivalent of an independent city that's not a county. And they have some of those around the country. But there are 3,000 of those entities. Now, 150 of the 3,000 house 50% of our entire population, right? So 3,000 counties and you cull it down to 150 counties have half of our population. And that's important to understand because that talks about the rural, uh, urban divide thing that's going on in the country, but I don't, I don't want to go into that. Now, of the 150, of the 150 counties, eight, eight, comprise 70%, 70% of all the murders, for any reason, all the murders in this country. Now think about that. Eight counties represent 70% of all murders. Uh, Ninety percent of all murders are in 60 of the 150 counties. It is not an epidemic. The country does not have an epidemic. In those 60 counties, somebody needs to pay attention. Uh, an important demographic is that almost all of those 60 counties are predominantly black or have a majority of black. And all of them are 50% lower than the poverty line, or than the median income in the country. Right? Now, there is a Maj Touré, who is with Black Guns Matter, uh, has been talking about this. Uh, Colion Noir has been talking about this, is that the issue is to get at the social things that cause this to happen. No one is doing that. No one is. This has nothing to do with guns. Yes, there is violence. Yes. Uh, but it's not a gun violence issue. It never has been. So let me take it a little further, right? Since the 90s, the, the, the highest crime rate, the highest murder violence rate was in, in the 90s, in the early 90s, when uh, our government pumped crack cocaine into the black neighborhoods and the rest is history 
It brought us the war on drugs, would increase the number of fe black felons that are going into the prison system and so forth. Because we can't have black folks with guns, so let's turn them all into felons. But I, I don't want to go off into a tangent on that. But that is, in fact, what happened. Uh, but the, the, the nominal uh, gun violence rate per 100,000 hasn't changed much. It's between four and six per 100,000 and has been that way for decades. It might cycle up or down a little bit, but it kind of stays, stays in there. In 2019, and I haven't got the data for 2020 yet, there were 16,000 murders, 16,000 murders, homicides, for whatever reason, excluding law enforcement, 16,000, and it wasn't a lot of law enforcement. Of the 16,000, 6,000 were homicides by firearm of all types, mostly handguns, right? We do not have a gun violence epidemic in the United States. And anyone that professes and talks that language is, for all intents and purposes, a liar. That's, there's, there's no more gentle word to say than that. They are lying to you and they are lying to others. Right? There is no gun violence epidemic in the United States. Um, what is necessary to address violence, and by the way, we are not the most violent country in the world either, but to, I mean, if you want to address violence, you address violence. I have some thoughts on that, but most of them would be unconstitutional, so I'm not going to go there, right? So, any thoughts you might have, I'd appreciate if anyone wants to argue this, be more than happy. The data is the data. There is no gun violence epidemic in the United States. There is no mass shooting epidemic in the United States as well. Anyone that would like to comment, please do. If you would like to subscribe, please do. Don't forget to hit that bell icon so you get notified. As always, thanks for watching. Carry on.